today is Saturday. It is 8.45 in the morning. I didn't really get a great night's sleep last night. I still have like my morning voice. Um, but when I asked everyone on my Instagram, like what you guys wanted to see more of, see less of, etc., um, pretty much everyone said that they wanted me to get back to doing vlogs and I haven't vlogged in a while. So even though I didn't get a great night's sleep today, I really like wanted to commit to vlogging today. I'm honestly not doing that much, but I still thought I would take you guys through my day. Um, I'm going to make some breakfast and then I'm going to go for a walk and then my sister is coming. So yeah, I'll show you guys. I think I'm going to have oatmeal for breakfast because it's starting to be like those cozy vault fall vibes outside and I have been switching up my breakfast lately. I've been having like paleo toaster waffles. I've been making some pumpkin pancakes and I've also discovered Three Wishes cereal which is so good. Um, but anyone who's a loyal Instagram follower knows that like oatmeal just has my heart. So between the fact that I'm obsessed with oatmeal and the fact that it's like so cozy out today, it's still in the 50s right now since it's so early but it's gonna go up to the 60s. Oatmeal just sounds like it would warm up my soul. I don't know, that sounds weird, but it's true. So I'll show you guys how I make my famous oatmeal bowls, and then we'll head out for a walk. Okay, you guys, so this is everything you need right here. I have my Bob's Red Milk gluten-free rolled oats, all natural creamy peanut butter, unsalted. I use Vital Protein Collagen. Oat milk, I usually use Califia, but I was at Trader Joe's, so I just picked this up. A bunch of different fruit, really totally up to you. I have blueberries, raspberries, half a banana. I usually eat the other half throughout the day for a snack. And then whatever superfoods you want on top. So today I'm using cacao and goji berries, but I'll also use like hemp seeds, chia seeds, flax, anything that floats your boat. Oh, something important to note, I don't use the full half, uh, full cup of liquid that they recommend because I don't like it to be too liquidy. I like it to have like a thicker texture. So what I do is I use, I use the half cup measuring cup to split it between water and oat milk, but I don't fill the half cup all the way for either thing. So it ends up being like three quarters cup liquid to half a cup of oats. And then I give it a stir and we oat microwave for two minutes. Okay, in the meantime, I will wash my berries. Gotta remember to wash that produce. Guys, I give serious major credit to any like real vloggers. I mean, I don't consider myself a real vlogger. I can't even get my camera to focus, but doing stuff one-handed is so hard, I couldn't do it. So yeah, here we are. Maybe let's move this over here. Bear with me, still totally getting the hang of this. I look like a ghost. I am in my Target pajamas. Really, really sexy for you guys. Okay, let's get a good amount of razzles in there. And some blueberries. And I just do this part while the oatmeal cooks. Like, I don't do any preparation or anything. And then obviously the banana doesn't need to be washed, but... See, I can't even show you guys my berries. I don't know what I'm doing. It's done. I'm so excited. Okay, here we go. Careful not to burn yourself on the bowl like I almost just did. So the first thing I do is I take, once it's out of the microwave, I take this collagen and I take two big spoonfuls of it. It literally has no flavor, which I love, so you can't tell, but you're getting all of these extra added benefits by putting it in. I do like two small spoonfuls and then I stir it right in. So collagen is really good for your hair, your skin, your nails, and it has protein in it. And I love that you can't taste it and it's just a way to mix in some added benefits to your morning. After that's all mixed in, I go in with my half a banana. And like I said, I'll have the other half throughout the day 
like as a snack with some peanut butter or on a rice cake. Just makes for like a really easy snack. Slice it up, put it in there. I'm not really trying very hard today to make this one pretty just because I really want to get on my walk and it does take a little bit of time. Then we'll go in with the berries. Just sprinkle them in right on top. Once those are in there, hmm, I'm gonna go in with the goji berries full of antioxidants, which we could all always use. Sprinkle them right on top. And the same goes for the cacao nibs. So I will just sprinkle them on. I love how these add like an extra little crunch. Such a little nice thing to bite into in your soft oatmeal. Then I drizzle some peanut butter on top. This is the one I like best. It's literally just the um, Whole Foods brand, but it's organic and unsweetened and no salt. So it's literally the only ingredient is organic dry roasted peanuts, which is what I love to see. Um, there's totally nothing wrong with like Jif or Skippy or anything like that. This is honestly just what I prefer after so many years of having like peanut butter and jelly with Jif, like my body honestly just craves this kind. Oh my God, she honestly is a beaut, guys. Even though I wasn't trying, I swear she's actually stunning. Let me show you. I mean, look at her, she is beautiful. Actually stunning, I'm so impressed with myself. Okay, ow, literally burned my finger. I need to get it together today. I forgot to tell you guys, I also love putting like a hefty dash of cinnamon on top. Not only is cinnamon amazing for you, but it tastes fantastic, makes it that much cozier, but it's not very pretty. So I always do it after the picture and now I'm gonna eat. Also, I'm not sure if this is of any interest to literally anyone, but I wanted to show you guys the supplements I take in the morning. I take this cranberry pill, um, zinc, this probiotic, but I wanna switch to seed soon, and then um, magnesium. So magnesium is really good for sleep and digestion. Zinc is good for your immunity. We started taking it at the beginning of Corona. Cranberry pill for pH balance and a line probiotic for digestive support and just really good for your gut. So that is that. I love this weather. So gorgeous. Hello to my shadow. You guys, oh my God, it is the most crisp and delicious fall weather today ever. It is beautiful out. There's like this delicious breeze. The sky is so blue. The sun is shining so bright. I'm wearing my sunglasses. I can't even tell. Okay, yeah, I'm in the viewfinder, but I can't tell. Oh my God, this embarrassing cars are passing and I'm literally holding my camera in front of me. I probably look so silly and my mom's probably gonna be so angry when she realizes that I was walking and vlogging, but I swear I'm being safe. I literally can't see the screen right now because of my sunglasses, so I have no idea if I'm in it. But I'm not teaching any classes today. I'm not doing any sort of hard, intense gym workout. So on my rest days, oh my God, it is so windy. Can you guys hear it? You can probably see it in my hair. Um, but on my rest days, depending on how many rest days I take a week, if I'm only taking one rest day that week, then I like to do absolutely nothing on that rest day to make sure that my body is actually getting the recovery that it needs. But if I'm taking two rest days like I did this week, I took one on Tuesday, then on one of those rest days, I like to do like a long walk. I like to get in some low impact movement because it feels so good and movement is just my favorite way to start the day. I feel like it really just sets the tone and sets me up for success the rest of the day. Um, so yeah, today is Rosh Hashanah, which is why my sister is coming home. So Shana Tova to anyone who celebrates. I'm wishing you the happiest and healthiest new year. I don't know when this will go up, but I think it will still be relevant. I'm gonna try to get it up really soon. And yeah, I'm gonna enjoy the rest of my walk. Put my camera away. I promise there are no cars while I'm filming this right now. And I'll talk to you guys after. I know I said I was done, but I forgot to tell you guys my entire outfit is Lululemon. Um, oh wow, the lighting's so much better this way. Okay, oops, I know better for next time. I'm back from my walk and I'm about to bake this cinnamon swirl bread. 
with Apple from Wake Up and Kale. It looks so good and yeah, I'm really excited. It looks delicious. I wish you guys could smell this right now. It smells absolutely incredible. Literally like a fall Cinnabon candle. Oh my gosh, magnificent. I'm gonna probably post this on my Instagram with a link to the recipe so you guys can bake it too, but I'm really excited. It's perfect for the holiday and it just looks so yummy. This has been my go-to lunch recently. It's the sourdough from Trader Joe's with a little bit of Kite Hill vegan cream cheese, avocado, tomato, and sea salt. It is so good. Hi, you guys. We are going apple picking. I'm so excited. It's the perfect fall day. This is my sister, Kira. Hi. We obviously have our masks on, being totally safe, taking all the precautions, but I'm very excited. I feel like this is the official kickoff to fall, the official start when you go apple picking. That's when you know, and I'll keep you guys updated. guys, I think I'm going to end off this vlog here because I want tonight to just sort of be a family moment. We're having a family dinner, my mom is cooking, and I just want to be present and in the moment. So please like and subscribe if you're not already. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and that you will tune in for hopefully another one soon. I really am going to try to be consistent with vlogging and really get into it because it it'll, is a lot of fun. I guess I need to get better with my pronunciation if I'm gonna keep doing this. Um, plus I have this cut on the bottom of my tongue that hurts so much and if you've ever had a cut on the inside of your mouth you know the struggle is so real because it literally ruins all of my favorite activities like talking and eating because it's so painful. Um, but a few of you guys told me to gargle with salt water so I'm gonna do that. But again, thank you guys for watching. Um, I hope my day was entertaining. I didn't really do all that much, but apple picking was super fun. It was good to feel normal. Everyone was wearing masks, which made me feel very safe. And it was also just good to see that everyone was sort of on the same page and cooperating. And just all the fall vibes made me super happy. It's good to be with my sister. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.